Do you guys really truly believe that I'm leaving Estes because of a bid run? <laughs> But I just want to get, I just want to clear the air a little bit and get into it. Okay, so we have three line haul bid runs at my terminal. Do you guys understand that, right? We have three. I have one. You see how that's working out. The second of the three is held by a man who's been doing the same thing for 20 years. He's not giving that up until he retires. He already told me. It is basically a double Memphis, except he gets a double turn every night. I would say 99% of the time. So, he's going to get that turn every night. The third bid run driver leaves the terminal. He goes and lays down in a motel somewhere. He just does it all week. Back and forth, back and forth. I used to think I wanted that run. I used to think that I wanted that run until I realized now I'm home more than he is, but he does make more money than me. So those are the three options. For and Only two of those options allow me to be home every day. No one wants to turn a double. That's why I'm doing it, because nobody else wants it and you know, I wanted to be home every day. I've been over the road five years. I'm tired of being over the road. I got little kids at home, a wife, young wife. I'm a young man. We need to be together. So with this bid run, it allows me to do that. And I'm still making a decent wage. No, I'm not making two grand a week anymore. Not every week. I'm not making 2,200 bucks a week. This run isn't paying me $2,300 a week like it's supposed to. And yeah, that frustrates me a little bit, but I am getting everything that I want out of this run. Now, the only problem is, well, with those being the only three options for a bid run, and this terminal's been in Little Rock how long? 40 years or something? And that's as far as we've made it? I'm sorry, but I don't want to spend the next 30 years <laughs> doing this run. There's no... Somebody made a really good point on my video yesterday, okay? Here's the point. Jump back on the extra board. Build up seniority until you can, until you have enough seniority to bid on the run you want. Well, that's the problem. There are no bid runs that I want. It's either this, this, but with double turns every night or the lay down run. That's the only option as for line haul bid runs go. Now we do have three hub positions working the dock. You guys already know how I feel about that. I ain't doing that. So we only got three line haul spots. Um, so yeah, I could run this out for a year next March or whenever bid season is next March, right? Jump off the run go back on the extra board because we already know there's not going to be another run this is all there is it's all there's been for years i mean there's not gonna be anything else uh, so i could jump off the run go back over the road instead of being home every day but for what reason you're not going to get a better bid There's those are the only three there are i mean come on you want any of those chris no <laughs> okay so what am I saying here? I'm talking about career, I guess you could call it career progression because that's basically what I'm talking about, progressing with Estes. Now, this is not a company issue. This is just a Little Rock terminal issue. And that's really kind of why I'm leaning more toward Old Dominion, which I haven't even gotten the job yet. I did have an interview. I did the interview. I got some questions answered. Here's the thing, extra board at Old Dominion, home every night, home every night. Uh, yeah, you may occasionally stay out in the hotel, but you're pretty much home every day, okay? And when you're not home every day, I mean, when you're not uh, just running extra freight, you're covering bid runs, 
And guys, I'm going to tell you, they have way more than just three line haul bids. But, why even get off the extra board? I guess I'll find that out if I get a job over there and uh, see how it pans out. But everything else seems to be good over there. I mean, over there, you can get on the extra board. Until you build up 10, 15 years of seniority and say, hey, I want that Dallas turn you got over there. Because they got two of those over there at Old Dominion. Yeah. I've been wanting one of those, right? SS ain't got them. Old Dominion has two. Now listen, Old Dominion does have double Memphis turns. And yes, it is true. I could be in a situation where I am the lowest ranking member of the team, as far as seniority goes. And uh, the guy that's on that double Memphis jumps off, and I'm forced to take it because I am the lowest ranking guy there. And it could be more of what's going on now. But if that happens at Old Dominion, I'm okay with it. So now you're going to say, well, Chris, if that happens at Estes, why aren't you okay with it? Here's the, here's the difference. At Old Dominion, I can wait until someone else gets hired below me, maybe a year, maybe two years, and then I'll get off the run. They take it, and I can go on the extra board and still be home every day. I can jump off the run here next February or March and do what? Be over the road for five days. So be home daily or, or, or over the road five days. Which one would you rather do? And make the same money, by the way. So which one would you rather do? I would rather be home every day. So that is kind of why I'm leaving, or why I'm looking to leave Estes. It has nothing at all to do with the company. It doesn't have anything at all to do with this run, because like I said multiple times before, I knew the run had problems. Now, I did not know why the run had problems. I do now, which is kind of what I explained yesterday in the video. But that is not why I'm leaving the company, okay? I want you guys to get that through your head. It's not why I'm leaving the company. It's just that my terminal has three line haul bid runs. Okay? There's no room to grow here. There's no room to... There's only two runs that are home daily. One guy's been on the run for 20 years. It's a double turn every night. He's not getting off that for 10 or 15 years. And I don't even want it. So I'm basically left doing this what I'm doing now, if I want to be home daily at my terminal, exactly what I'm doing now for the next 30 years. I don't think so. I don't think so. So uh, I hope Old Dominion hires me. I'll find out next week. If they don't, then they don't. So don't take the video the wrong way, guys. I do not dislike Estes at all. I love this company. And if, I, if they had more home daily stuff to choose from at my terminal, <laughs> I wouldn't even be leaving. I would stay here until I had a few more years of seniority, and boom, you know, jump right into another uh, another uh, bid. So I have nothing against Estes. I don't think Estes Old Dominion, which one's better? I don't think. I think they're equal. But I'm just telling you, from my standpoint, where I stand on things at my terminal, Old Dominion is a better fit for me at the moment because they have more bid runs. They have way more bid runs than Little Rock has this terminal ever thought about having. So you got more opportunity. And on their extra board, you're home daily at least most of the time. So, uh, you know, like I said, even if you're in the same situation, if I'm put in the same situation at Old Dominion that I'm currently in, <clears throat> I'm okay with that. I don't hate the bid run. I don't hate going home early. I don't hate losing, uh, what is that, seven, eight hundred dollars, eight hundred miles a week. I don't, I don't care. I'm home every day, bro. I told you, I can live on an eight hundred dollar take home every week. I don't need to make more than that. I want to, so I got more money to buy more things, but I don't have to. Do you understand? There's a difference. And some of you guys can probably survive on less, so it's not about money at all. It's not about the bid run. It's not really about what's going on with the bid run. I was just explaining that to you guys yesterday so you knew what was going on. That's it. I have a lot of people ask me, how's the bid run going? That's how it's going. Swimmingly. <laughs>